We can position our HTML elements in different ways, using the position property in our style sheet. Positioning is a very important concept because it will be used extensively when developing CSS-based web page layouts. There are four main types of position declarations that we will explore. Static, Relative, Absolute, and Fixed. The first and most basic position declaration is the static position. Static is actually the default position of an, of an element if no position is specified. We've already worked with this many times. On this HTML page, we have a div that references ID selector div1. We've defined some basic properties, including background color, width, and height. Note that we have not declared a position property. Let's take a look at this page in our web browser to see what it looks like. We can see that the div is positioned where we might expect, at the top left corner of the content area, because that's where the content of our body would normally begin. Without specifying a position property, the default position is known as the static position. The element will inherit its position based on the normal flow of content on the page. If we wanted to specify the position is static, we could do so by creating this declaration. And when we refresh our web browser, there should be no change in positioning.